Hey everyone, I wanted to take some time this morning to explain what it really takes to build a hand-built sports car from scratch. We started with a drawing that was converted to 3D data. The 3D data was used to generate a station buck, and that station pro buck provides us with surface information for the body. We also simultaneously built a chassis, just the base chassis, two main frame rails, a couple of outriggers, just the bare bones, so we had the wheelbase and the track width correct. We then added portions of the station buck and what's called a wire form to show us where we can add chassis components, body structures, openings, closures, and a bunch of additional details. I can grab the camera and show you what I'm talking about. Here you see the wire form. This is what provides information about the external surface of the car, the sheet metal. So we're using that as a gauge to know where our limits are, where we can put structural pieces, cladding support components, where the grill opening is going to be, wheel arches, door openings, and the deck lid. The thin wires here, which I have wires on the front also, but this is showing us roughly where our, our deck lid opening is going to be. The next step is to add some cladding strips, which the body will be wrapped onto. Um, and this will be built in a very traditional method like 50s and 60s vintage race cars. So hopefully this sheds a little bit of light on, on how we've gotten to this point and there will be more coming up and I'll keep you updated as we move along. Thanks for watching.